Hey you guys, it's your boy Odin from Hostop Promo and in this video I'm going to show you how you can run and compile C and C++ files very easily in the Atom editor. All we need to do is just download one plugin to go ahead and do that. So we go to edit and then click preferences which you can usually access through control comma and then once you're there you need to go to install. Now we're going to type in GPP compiler and this extension right here built by crisscross07 we want to go ahead and install this extension it will take about 30 seconds to one minute to install once it's installed i want to show you guys something very important in the setting so you don't run into this issue uh, if you come down here and it says linux terminal and maybe slightly different on apple or mac the default terminal is called xterm okay most Linux distributions don't have this. They actually use the GNOME terminal. So you may want to select that. Or what you can do is you can just simply install Xterm. Uh, let me go ahead and show you how to do that on Linux. sudo apt-get install Xterm. You can figure out what terminal your computer is using and just set it to that. Or you can download Xterm. It doesn't really matter. They're going to pretty much do the same thing. I just wanted to show you guys that so you don't have that issue. So now let's go back to the C file. And if we press control P, control shift P, and type in GPP, you see there's two new commands we can run. And uh, it says F5 and F6. You actually have to press the function key and then F5 or F6. But we want to do the compile one, so we can go ahead and do this. And then boom, you see the X term terminal pops open and it says hello world. Uh, we're going to go ahead and exit that, and I'm going to just do... Uh, function key and then F5 and boom it does the same thing so if you guys found that helpful uh, make sure to like comment and subscribe and check out my website host.promo and I hope you guys have an amazing rest of the day peace out